Hello everyone. Today we will discuss space policy. Space policy 2023. India space policy 2023 has been declared by Union Cabinet Government. It is to boost the country's share in the global space economy and increase private participation. The policy thrust on privatization will enable the space sector to be more innovative and sustainable. It is crucial if India wants to be competitive in global space ecosystems. The space sector has remained within the confines of the Indian Space Research Organization ISRO, with full budgetary support from the government. Promising Key Points of Space Policy The government aims to drive the overall growth of Indian commercial space activities by creating a regulatory environment in compliance with international law encouraging the private sector to grow, eliminating the previous hurdles. The policy will throw much clarity on the regulatory framework which concerns the diverse activities which range from remote sensing to deep space exploration. India's space policy roadmap to result in a 5x rise in the country's global market share. The policy also directs and provides a greater opportunity, more time and resources to focus on deep space scientific and technological research. ISRO to move operational activities to NSIL. The operational part of ISRO's missions will be moved to the New Space India Limited, a public sector undertaking under the Department of Space. India's share in the global space economy was less than 2% at present and the space policy will help it increase substantially to 10% in the future. Under the policy guidelines, the repetitive operational work being done by ISRO building of building rockets and satellites with mature technology for instance will be shifted to Space PSU New Space India Limited NSIL. It activates a commercial mode wherein a user needing a satellite will fund its development. ISRO will not do any operational and production work for the space sector and focus its energies on developing new technologies, new systems, and research and development. The operational part of ISRO's missions will be moved to the New Space India Limited, a public sector undertaking under the Department of Space. The INSPACE, created recently, will be the interface between Indian Space Research Organization and non-governmental entities. Policy will allow the private sector to take part in end-to-end -end space activities that include building satellites, rockets, and launch vehicles, data collection, and dissemination. Space is an excellent commercial venture for a mature space program like that of India. It needs continuous R&D which can very well be done by private players. India is a party to the UN treaties on outer space activities and the domestic entities need to be regulated by local legislation. The bill also does not categorically cover space debris. It does impose the responsibility to keep the space environment clean, but again is ambiguous. The government reserves the right to impose control over imaging tasks and distribution of data from Indian remote sensing satellites when it is believed that national security and or international obligations and or foreign policies of the government so require. According to the policy, the National Remote Sensing Center NRSC, has been vested with the authority to acquire and disseminate all satellite remote sensing data in India from both Indian and foreign satellites for development purposes. India's private sector will be able to participate in India's space journey through a new agency known as InSpace. InSpace is a single window nodal agency established to boost the commercialization of Indian space activities. A supplement to the ISRO, the agency is to promote the entry of the non-governmental private entities NGPs, in the Indian space sector. It also has to work out a suitable mechanism to encourage NGPs participation in the space activities, promotion and hand-holding, 
sharing of technology and expertise. The agency has also to work out a mechanism to offer various facilities free of cost or at a reasonable cost basis to the NGPs. Thank you so much. Do subscribe UIS.